Another way to get into the holiday spirit, it's uh, attending a concert, right? Yeah, and we are about to preview one. The Minnesota Adult and Teen Challenge Choir members are getting ready for their 10th annual holiday concert. This is Tracy Anderson from Minnesota Adult and Teen Challenge. Thanks for coming in this morning. Thanks for having us. Uh, this is a great tradition that you guys have with your choir. Why don't we start for people who may not know, what does a Minnesota Adult and Teen Challenge do? So we are a um, drug and alcohol treatment and recovery program and we focus on helping everyone we can find freedom from drug and alcohol addiction. And tell us about the choir that is so unique because I know um, your clients oftentimes don't have any sort of professional singing background or even choir experience, but here they are singing in this choir. Right. How does it benefit their recovery? Yeah, so all of our clients in our long-term program, which is anywhere from 12 to 15 months, they participate in a choir and they go out and to churches on Sundays and they sing um, and share their testimonies with the choir members. And it really- You kind of make them do it, right? Yeah. This is part of the deal. Yeah. You sign up for treatment, you're joining yeah. the choir. It's, re it's a required part and it really helps them kind of gain confidence back and, and they start giving back to the community. And, it, yeah. Very cool. And then you have this huge concert that has, this year the choir has how many people? 350. That's, wow. Yeah. And you have some alums coming back to be yeah, part of it too. Yeah, there about 20 special alumni that have um, been through our program and they'll be coming back to sing too. When you talk to people who successfully go through the program, do they talk about the choir or about what that meant? Them? Yeah, you know, they, they didn't, a lot of them didn't know that they could sing and they, they, they all do solos as well and they'll, you know, sign up and trial for that and, um, and even speaking in front of people, they weren't mm -hmm. used to doing that either. So when they share their, their, you know, struggles with the, um, other choir members right, and, and the congregation. It helps them it? gain their sure. confidence and just um, start giving back to the community. Oh, that's so fantastic. What a great opportunity for people who are recovering from drug and alcohol addiction. And we do have the information on the concert if you want to attend. It's Saturday, December 16th, 3 and 7 p.m., two shows at Grace Church in Eden Prairie. $10 is what uh, tickets start at. We have more information on the website and the money you guys raise goes right back in the program, right? right? Very Fantastic. good. Tracy, Thanks. thank you so much. And we're going to get a preview of the right. concert right now. Who do we have singing for us? This is Mike Chorus. All right, Mike, take it away. Baby Jesus born in a manger, humble Savior's birth. You left your throne in heaven above to live here on the earth. Baby Jesus lying in a manger, crying for the world. Your shepherds told the shepherds of the good news for us all. Hallelujah, the King is here. Given for all men, for today the Holy Son of God is born in Bethlehem. Of all sinners and he sins. All right, my chorus, thank you very awesome. much. I sounded so good. good.